The Gila Conservation Coalition started the Gila River Festival 14 years ago. This is the 14th annual Gila River Festival. And the reason why is to bring people together to celebrate this last wild river in New Mexico, give people an opportunity to experience the river. We have field trips, we have presentations, workshops. We really try and take a multidisciplinary approach to getting people to enjoy and understand the value of the Gila River from a bunch of different perspectives. And that's really the purpose of the Gila River Festival is really to provide an opportunity for people to come to the river, experience it, and gain a, a new appreciation and understanding for this last wild river in the state. The Gila River has outstandingly remarkable values um, that make it eligible for wild and scenic river designation under the National Wild and Scenic Rivers Act. And the Gila River is just really important to our ecology. It supports one of the last intact riparian bosques in the lower Colorado River Basin. Seven threatened and endangered species. It's got cultural importance geologic importance. It's uh, really a, a treasure that we have here in southwestern New Mexico and that contributes as well to our local economy because it really draws people from all over the state, region, nation, the world to our corner of southwestern New Mexico. This tour that we're doing today is designed to showcase the wild and scenic nature of the Gila River. And so the participants that came out here today are coming to see some of that beautiful nature and experience it for themselves. Uh, having all this water is a real attraction for a lot of native wildlife uh, species that truly depend on it. The Gila River is the last free-flowing river in the southwest. There's not a single river mile in southern New Mexico that is designated as wild and scenic. And we believe that designating uh, the Gila River as wild and scenic honors uh, the Gila wilderness as America's first wilderness area. It's really fitting for that designation. What's my favorite part about southern New Mexico? It's got to be the Gila Wilderness. It's, living in Silver City, you've got 3.3 million acres of public land right outside your backyard. So having that available uh, and open to the public is a wonderful thing that we should all be proud of as New Mexicans. Well, we hope for the future that we can have uh, legislation introduced in Congress to permanently protect uh, the Gila River as wild and scenic and its main tributaries as wild and scenic. Gila Wilderness is uh, America's first wilderness area. So the idea of wilderness protection began right here uh, in the Gila with the Gila River. Passing on that legacy to future generations is a great thing uh, that we have here in New Mexico. The Gila River Festival is mostly free. So we really want to invite people to come to all of our events. No one is turned away for lack of funds. So we ask for donations to participate. So we want to be open to the community and really invite everybody to participate. It's always held the third weekend of September. In terms of planning, people can well in advance kind of block out that weekend. The Gila River Festival has a web page at GilaRiverFestival.org and they can find out more about all the field trips we have available, all the events, how they can help sponsorships, uh, registering for events, so that's your go-to location to find out more about the annual Gila River Festival. We have all these beautiful places that we can take advantage of and visit and enjoy, so um, this really is a special, special place.